Does this sign indicate the end of the built-up area? The answer is yes. In this situation, are you obliged to exercise caution? The answer is yes. Are you only allowed to turn left at this intersection? The answer is yes. Are you obliged to exercise particular caution when passing a vehicle marked in such a way? The answer is yes. Are you warned in this situation of a hump on the road intended to slow down the traffic? The answer is no. Do you have the right of way over all vehicles at an intersection marked in such a way? The answer is no. In this situation, do you have the right of way at the nearest intersection over vehicles approaching from the left side? The answer is yes. Is it reasonable to use the horn repeatedly instead of stopping the vehicle? The answer is no. The driver of the oncoming car intends to turn left. Do you have to yield the right of way to him? The answer is yes. You intend to go straight on. Do you have the right of way over the motorcyclist? The answer is no. Can you put a sterile gauze compress directly on the wound? The answer is yes. In the presented situation, are you allowed to turn right without stopping before the traffic lights? The answer is no. In this situation, are you allowed to drive across the pedestrian crossing without stopping? The answer is yes. You are driving a vehicle in a built-up area. Does the visible prohibition sign apply to passenger cars? The answer is yes. Are you permitted, in this situation, to enter the level crossing only after making sure that no rail vehicle is approaching? The answer is yes. On this road, once you go past this sign, are you obliged to give the right of way to the pedestrian walking in the middle of the road? The answer is yes. Are you obliged to exercise particular caution in this situation and stop the vehicle if the need be? The answer is yes. In this situation, do you have priority over the vehicle driving from the left into the traffic lane? The answer is no. You are driving a vehicle which does not perform payable transport of passengers on regular lines. Are you allowed in this situation to change into the right lane? The answer is no. Are you allowed in this situation to drive into the intersection without stopping the vehicle before the presented solid line? The answer is no. What is the most relevant information for paramedics when indicating the location of the road accident? Name of street and house number or name of road and the name of the nearest town, kilometer marker. Who is obliged to use seat belts? The driver and all the passengers. How long should you stabilize the head of a trauma patient manually? Until it is taken over by a member of medical rescue team. Are allowed to drive if your driving license is invalid? No. Does the driving license, CAT, B entitle you to ride a moped or a light for wheel vehicle? Yes. How does the braking distance of the vehicle change dependent on the speed increase? The braking distance increases with an increase in speed. What minimum distance should you keep from the car in front of you when stuck in a traffic jam in a tunnel? Pinch M. Which of the following combination vehicles can you drive if you have a B category driving license? A truck with gross vehicle weight of 2.5 T with a light trailer. What are responsibilities of the person involved in the traffic accident in which there are victims? Offer assistance to victims of the accident as well as call an ambulance and the police. How many persons, including yourself, can you transport when you drive a passenger car? As many persons as the number of seats specified on the registration card. Which of the following speeds is not allowed in a residential area? 25 km na godzinę. 
At what maximum speed limit can you drive a passenger car of maximum permissible weight 3T on a single carriage expressway? 100 km na godzinę.